hey boo if you're new to my channel welcome welcome i hope you consider staying and subscribing but if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much you're the real mvp now i know if you've been an og and for those of you who are always coming back to check out my channel and watch my videos i'm so grateful but there's been a little bit inconsistency there and that's because you know life happens and we, we gotta take care of what we need to do you know <laughs> but i'm so grateful to those of you who have been coming back and continuing to support me i am very very grateful for each and every one of you but of course let's get into this hair growth challenge that i did now note that i did do my length check i think a day before i will hopefully remember to insert a screenshot to show you the details so that you know i can show you that yeah i did record while i was doing my 21 day fenugreek challenge however this particular update is being filmed and of course the video is coming out after i'm done with that challenge this is about a week after and let me just say i am i'm happy with fenugreek the only thing i am not happy about is that i didn't manage to try out using it as a deep conditioner but you know i'm looking into that because it does require me to um get a blender so either uh i have to look into how we can get ours fixed because the ones we used to use are not okay or just getting one of those like really small portable ones so i can be using them specifically for my hair stuff i think my mom would prefer that and i think that would be better too but for now i'm very happy i have continued using both the fenugreek oil that i made and the fenugreek and flaxseed gel they have been working amazing for my hair and i believe that using that plus the having a protective style in and really paying attention to it you know i already mentioned last time i think when i did my protective style challenge i talked about everything i was happy about and how i know for sure that protective styles help me grow hair so even now you know i'm just giving my hair a break from all the tension um but i'm still definitely going to do another protective style probably by next week i should have it done so yeah that's about the fenugreek and i'm looking into more ways i can use it as i said deep conditioner i'm yet to use it as a spray because i already have the fenugreek and flaxseed gel as my daily moisturizer so i don't think i'll be going that route as of right now that may change but i don't know but that has been my experience so far with fenugreek my hair has been you know staying moisturized for longer granted the weather is getting hotter now so of course my hair won't um um keep moisture as long in winter it was dry but at least it wasn't hot so now we have both hot and dry weather so i'm not surprised that my hair is not holding on to moisture as good as it was the past few weeks especially when it was in a protective style however it is doing way better than before when i wasn't consistent with things like moisturizing my hair and of course the way i described my new routine where i do wash my hair twice a week and i would say the 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 wash that i do midweek is not really like a you know cleansing get everything out wash it's more so just to get as much moisture into my hair because i know that that has been working very well for me so yeah i'm happy with the fenugreek it's definitely one of those ingredients that is very versatile and you can actually ingest it which is what i like whenever i'm doing a hair growth challenge um i like things that i can not only use topically but because i know that they are things that i can you know in some way ingest i'm a little bit less concerned about things like getting any type of reaction but of course with any Anything you see me use always make sure that if you're going to try something be careful start a little bit at a time and then see how your hair or your skin or your body reacts to that specific ingredient so yeah fenugreek is staying we like her she's she's doing her thing and i think there's more ways that she's probably going to benefit my hair as we go along and i'm excited to see that um so yeah let's get into my length check and then we will end this video
So as you can see, I made a lot of progress. So that is why even now, even though I do not have extensions in my hair, protective styles, I'm taking them more seriously. Fenugreek, flax seeds, my, you know, little scalp oil that I now have specific ingredients that I know work well for my hair. We are staying on course. And yeah, as one of my, uh, in one of my previous videos, there is a viewer who commented, hey girl, just leave your hair alone. Girl, I agree. My hair likes a little nice ratio of 70% of leave me alone. And then, you know, when I need you to give me moisture, give me moisture. <laughs> so as I'm figuring out that balance, we'll go along, we'll document it. That's why my channel is here. So I can show you what I'm doing and hopefully that will help you and we can share, you know, we can share ideas and suggestions. So I'm happy with my progress. I've grown a lot of hair. I think in total probably by now maybe i'm even approaching an extra two centimeters from the time i started using the fenugreek perhaps maybe <laughs> but as you can see lots of progress and i'm happy about that the challenge now is to retain it so yeah thank you guys so much for watching as always any questions any suggestions any comments please leave them in the comment section down below i always enjoy interacting with you and finding out what you think what you would like to see it helps me out and i hope you consider subscribing if you're new i will see you in my next video bye